Hey everyone and welcome back to Coco's Cosmology. In today's reading, this reading is for my Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs. And this is for the week of December 6th through December 12th. So let's get right into your reading. Alright. What is going on with my Libras, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs during the week of December 6th? Through December 12th. What can they expect? What should they look out for? And what energy is surrounding them? Now, before we get into the reading, I want to give a quick disclaimer that I'm going to be shuffling out seven cards for you guys, and it is going to be going for seven days of the week. For some of you guys, this is going to happen in chronological order, and for other of you guys, it's going to be happen happening sporadically throughout the week, so take what resonates with you. All right, let's get into it. What is going on with my Libras, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs for the week of December 6th? We have the Seven of Cups for the first card. Alright, so we've got the Emperor. We have the Eight of Swords. We have the Nine of Pentacles. We have the Two of Pentacles. We've got a lot of earth sign energy, and then we have the eight of pentacles. Right. Can I get one more card for my Libras? Well, okay, two cards came out. It was Ace of Wands and the King of Wands. Back of deck energy is the King of Cups. And with this king of cups energy that is a very calm energy so that's the type of energy that you will be having during the week of december 6th through december 12th and also this energy is someone who someone can confide in so people may be coming to you with their problems and venting during the week of december 6th through december 12th all right so um, and also I noticed that you have one major arcana card, which is the emperor. And that is a very beautiful card to have, um, as your highlight for the week. So let's get right into the seven of cups energy. So with the seven of cups energy, um, you may be very creative during the beginning of the week. And also you may be tempted to do some things or you may be fantasizing about some things. I'm feeling like a lot of you guys will be fantasizing um, about something that's involving your emotions like your love life. You may be fantasizing about your career. You may be fantasizing about some things that you are wanting in your life um, at the moment or in the future. So um, pay attention to this energy. Um, I do like this energy, even though um, it can come off as delusional, but that's like that childlike energy where you are imagining things. And um, with this emperor energy followed by it, you can most definitely manifest um, the things that you are creating in your mind. But also with the emperor energy, you can, you know, um, manifest the responsibility in your life now um for some of you guys this week it may be highlighted by your father um or some father figure in your life um you may be getting advice from your father this week 
or your responsibilities may kick in. And also the emperor is about being someone who is reliable. So if you are a reliable person, which I'm pretty sure you are Libra, um, you know, that may be put to the test this week. Not in a bad way, but you know, you'll be able to show you know, show that you can handle any responsibilities um, coming your way. All right. So you guys, I'm seeing this eight of swords energy and this eight of swords energy is all about, you know, feeling like you can't do something. Now, Libra, um, sometimes, you know, you do tap in that energy where you just like, oh, things are getting overwhelming but I feel like this is just going to be you know an emotional um, patch during your week but it won't last long okay this is just you know you you getting in your head you thinking a lot about what is it can I do and how am I going to get this done but you have nine of pentacles supporting you two of pentacles eight of pentacles supporting you you have a lot of money supporting you so with this nine of pentacles you know supporting you you're stepping into your prosperity and you're also going to be feeling that comfort that comfort I apologize but you're going to feel comfortable you know what I'm saying um, you're going to feel well supported during this week you're going to be happy you know um, you may have some appointments that you have to get to during this week or some things that you need to get done and you're going to get through it with ease because you have this nine of pentacles supporting you um, but you did have that eight of swords all in your mind like oh how could you ever get this done or when would you get this done and this is spirit letting you know that everything is happening for a reason everything is you know going down the right path that it's supposed to go on because this is your life path this is the beautiful path that you have and sometimes Libra you get in your head about things that you're wanting to do and you may talk yourself out of it but this nine of pentacles is to assure you that you are divinely taken care of in all ways now with this two of pentacles energy um this week you're going to be juggling and balancing some things you know you're going to be showing the world and the people around you that you can handle it you know what i'm saying that this energy and these you know things that are coming towards you it is nothing to a boss okay like it's nothing new to it you know you're not new to this you true to this so pay attention to that energy um i highly recommend libra that you write to-do list um every day this week for the things that you have to do and just take a deep breath and mark them off as you go with it and go through with it all right and then with this eight of pentacles energy um a lot of you guys are in school or you guys are studying something you guys keep getting the eight of pentacles and all of your readings i feel like and you guys are going to be doing some hard work or you're going to be going to school or you're going to be concentrating on the tasks that you have to get done during the week so don't feel overwhelmed just take a deep breath see if you can find some help on delegating the things that you need to do so that everything can get done a lot of you guys may be um, starting a new job this week or um, or doing something that involves training now for the end of the week you have some fire sign energy coming in and you have the ace of wands and the king of wands now with the ace of wands um th some projects you know new projects may be coming into your life and you may be you know tapping into your creativity during the end of the week or at some point during the week and it's going to have you very excited and it's going to have you very ambitious with the things that you are wanting to do because you have the king of wands supporting the ace of wands and that's just like a full circle moment um the first card of the fire signs and the very last card and i feel like this this week will be a very successful week for you to start new projects and you know be creative so tap into that fire sign energy and you know enjoy it and embrace it this was a beautiful reading so far um, Libra 
So let's get into your numerology cards. The numerology cards are going to allow us to know what you should focus on mainly this week between December 6th through December 12th. So let's get right into that. All right. What should my Libra sun, moon, and rising signs focus on between December 6th through December 12th? Okay, so the first card we have is spiritual partnerships. So focusing on your spirituality, um, that may be something that you guys are focusing on with the Eight of Pentacles. A lot of you guys are um, concentrating very heavily on your spirituality and who your spiritual partners are. All right, the next card is love partnerships. So a lot of you guys will be focusing on your love life and the things that are going on around it. All right, and then we also have moderation. Take your time. You don't have to speed up and go fast to get things done. Just take your time. Like I was telling you, um, like I was telling you with this Eight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles energy, just um, take, write some lists down when it's time for you to get things done as far as your education, your training, um, and, you know, going back to school, studying for your spirituality and et cetera. All right, you guys, we're going to get into your Moon Allergy cards. The Moon Allergy cards are going to allow us to see um, what energies are surrounding you guys during the week of December 6th through December 12th. And the first card we have is Balance, Spirituality, and Practicality, Full Moon in Pisces. And then we have Expect, Powerful Change. That's the New Moon Eclipse. All right, can we get one more card for my Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign? For the week of December 6th through December 12th. And then we have conclusions are within reach. Full moon eclipse. Alright. Now we're going to get into the astrology cards. To see what other energies are surrounding you guys. During the week of December 6th through December 12th. Okay, first card we have is Jupiter. This is ruled by Sagittarius. Your confidence, courage, self-belief, and luck. We have Mercury, which is Gemini energy and Virgo energy. How you think, communicate, write, talk, and travel. Alright, can I get one more card? And we have Aquarius energy. This energy is freedom, loving, rebellious, idealistic, and technological. All right. Beautiful energy. All right. So we're going to get into the Starseed Oracle cards to see what messages you guys have from Spirit for the week of December 6th through December 12th. All right. What messages? Ooh. All right, so the first card that we have is You Got the Love. Wow. Hadarian Energy Codependency Boundaries. All right. And then we have You're Not Alone, Isolation, Physical Connection, and Community. And last but not least, we have is Double Mission, Light Worker, Star Seed, Serve the World by Being You. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this reading, Libra. Please give it a thumbs up. Leave comments down below. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you won't ever miss an upload. And I will see you guys in my next reading. Bye.